Multi-GP International Open is only a few weeks away. The burning man of drone racing is about to kick off. Over 300 pilots from around the globe will ascend down to Muncie, Indiana at the AMA headquarters. Here are a few things you'll need to know as you head down. If you're on the fence or haven't been yet, this may be the perfect year to make IO your first, whatever your skill level. Most events, one trophy, one contest. Not at IO. IO has multiple multiple different events, camping, golf carts, crazy stories. Eight tracks in the heart of the beautiful rolling fields of America is the perfect spot to feed your quads an all-you-can-eat lipo buffet. Tracks will be open with timing each day from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. and the schedule is available now to start planning your week. Last year, myself and many others fell into this sort of drone racing purgatory where we were too slow to compete in the bracket races of the top 64 for a World Cup, but too fast to compete in the intermediate brackets. This meant we missed out on some of that bracket adrenaline pumping competition. That's what you really want to go and participate in, and that's what really levels you up. When that pressure is on, then you really know how good your flight skills are. You need that true test, and this year, MultiGP has you covered. They have created a series of group races. Group races are the new 2023 format for International Open. Each pilot will be assigned a group based on the 20 three global qualifier ranking. If you can't make it to a GQ before the event starts, that's okay because GQ will be available on site. So the first day that you arrive, plan to check in and go straight to that GQ field in order to get your ranking to be assigned to your group. The groups are lipo fires, high voltage, cracked props, hammers, and burnt motors. All the things we normally try to avoid will be key to maximizing everyone's flight times. Each group should be made of about 40 pilots, making it the perfect size for flying as much as possible and also getting some real adrenaline pumping competition. While it is amazing to fly against the top pilots in the world, it can be a little nerve wracking when MCK or Heads Up blazes past you like your connection just lagged playing Call of Duty. Now you can target someone close to your skill level in your group and engage nemesis mode for some true skill based action since the group formations will level the playing field. Each group will race more than once, so once assigned prior to the race, use that to plan your schedule. The idea is for everyone to have a chance to compete in multiple races throughout the week. The other bracket races like World Cup, Freedom Spec, Street League, and the Seniors races will have qualifying on site, so pay attention to that schedule when you need to qualify for those if you plan to participate. Tickets will be on sale up to the event date, but they do go up in price on June 1st, so if you haven't took the time to invest in your flight future, now's the time. I'm going to go ahead and start a diet now because I'm planning to eat about 17 of those delicious pork loin sandwiches that they were selling at the food truck last year. Good lord! Even as somebody that's used to Texas barbecue, I have to say, those things were tasty. Some pilots spend more time just hanging out, drinking coffee, telling stories with each other. What the community of drone racing is about. Whether you know it or not, you have a lot of friends in this community. No matter what you're planning this year, just cancel it. Tell your boss. Don't ask, tell them you have to go to IO. Everybody's here, they're either racing or they're hanging out, having a good time. It's what IO is all about. Don't wait till you think you're good enough. If you can fly at all, you belong there. Come out, hang out, meet everyone, fly some packs, experience the Willy Wonka chocolate factory that is the Tiny Whoop tent. You won't regret it. Your golden ticket is just a click away.